were you uh were you all like was your family like a very like uh, exercise focused family or was it like not really i mean my sister and i did a lot of sports growing up like i did a lot of yeah. like tennis and stuff growing up i feel like everyone did a lot of sports growing up yeah that's just that's just like you have you just have not more anymore. energy as a kid no sports anymore okay uh, well, at, at which point at which point <laughs> at which point in your life right did you kind of realize at least at least, at least especially for you joey uh. wait at which point where you went through life and you're like i can just live my life, not think about health at all. And I'm never gonna gain any weight. Oh, I'm never gonna change That my was body. me in high school. That was like, <laughs> when I was in high school, you know, yeah. like six foot, 55 kilograms, right? Yeah. Bro, I was eating like eight sandwiches a day. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. Like I was like, you, you know, those like yeah, massive- I actually just loaves of bread. Yeah, the yeah. massive loaf of bread that has like the 12 to 14 slices yeah. in yeah. it that you can buy at the supermarket. I would, in the morning, my mom would make like six to seven sandwiches of that and just like refill the package with all of the sandwiches. And I would take that whole thing and I would finish that before lunch. And then I would come home, eat a massive dinner, you know, maybe you know, stop by at a Macca's on the way home after school yeah. with the 50 cents that I picked up from somewhere, right? Cause I was broke as shit. Yeah. Um, and yeah, I'd go home, take a fat shit, not gain a single kilogram. I'm like- <laughs> it, it came in one end and yeah. went out the I'm like, other. I am unstoppable. So when I, you know, finally moved out and I started living on my own. And then, you know, when I started, you know, this is like mid twenties for me. Yeah, I thought in my head, well, my metabolism was this goaded during high school and right. uni. It's going to keep going as usual. Yeah. So I just continued to eat like shit and not exercise. I, and then over the pandemic, I was the heaviest I've ever been. I think I think it was the pandemic that was the wake up call for me yeah. as well. I went from fifty five kilos to eighty kilos. <laughs> Jesus <laughs> Christ! <laughs> Whoa, yeah, that's a lot. Like eighty for my height and age is not fat necessarily, yeah. but. Compared to what I was, yeah. it's fat. Yeah. I mean, I, I'd say you gained a healthy amount of. I think I'd say you were yeah. probably. I didn't underweight. get fat. I got fatter. <laughs> <laughs> I went from severely um, underweight. Excuse me, to, you uh, bulked yeah. actually. <laughs> I, I, I I didn't go from zero to hundred. I went yeah. from minus hundred to zero, <laughs> essentially. <laughs> But I still wasn't happy with it because all that weight I gained was just purely fat. Yeah. Because yeah, I yeah, wasn't yeah. working out. I I never really had a lot of muscle in my body. Uh so yeah, that's when I was like, all right, CrossFit it is. And then yeah. now I, I'd say I've got the most muscle in my body I have oh ever yeah. in my life. And Fuck I yeah. wanna keep going with that. Oh Fuck yeah. yeah. I, mean, I wanna I wanna I, be I, just, I wanna be like the Zeus body. I just wanna work out to eat. That's, <laughs> that's all. I mean, yeah. yeah. I, I like I like this idea of Eating a fat curry, mm -hmm. slamming a beer, and being like, "All right, boys, let's go and do a workout." But I just my, don't want to be like those ninety-year-old like grandmas you see sometimes with the ninety-degree backs. I just don't want to be like that. No, nah. you know. Well, you, I mean, you're you have to go a long way to be like that. But, I know, uh, but that old after, shit. Yeah. after I threw my back out at age twenty-nine, bro, I was yeah. like, I'm one step closer to that <laughs> than I think I am. You know. Bro, why is life so unfair when it comes to calories, man? You like, it It just right. feels awful where you fucking, you work out, you feel like you've spent every energy within mm. your body. Mm. And then you realize this is uh this is just one beer. I've, I've been yeah. fine for my life for <laughs> one beer's worth of calories. Yeah, like <laughs> you've been walking around like all day, your feet mm. are tired, yeah. your back's starting to get sore and you're like, oh man, I must've burned a lot of calories and you check and it's like, you have burnt one bowl of rice worth. It's like, <laughs> cool, <laughs> awesome, <laughs> love it. It's also kind of cool as well when you, cause that's like a like a normal workout. I don't know, like if you did like a, a short run and maybe did some muscle, what's like 300 calories? Yeah, it's maybe. like three, 400 maybe. Yeah. Yeah. You're going like kind of, and the ramen have to be quite a lot, but then mm. you're like, well, that's still like an extra protein shake and a protein bar. And yeah, that's kind of nice. Yeah. That normally fills me up. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. That's true. Um, I don't know. I just, I just like eating. So it's kind of same, bro. Mm. Same. That's same. <laughs> <laughs> well, so Who doesn't? I, I did, that's uh, just the biggest I did problem. A, did the Spartan race with uh, Chris. Oh yeah, oh, how'd that go? It was fun. Yeah, it was great. It was kind of it was weird because um, what do you have to do on it? What's what does the yeah, what's the criteria? Race? Yeah, so it? it's not too bad. It's I think uh, maybe I don't know the, the exact amount of obstacles, but about twenty obstacles mm. and five k run. Okay, so not bad. Mm. Okay, um, this one was in some German park in Chiba. I think it's a German theme park in Chiba, didn't it? German they? theme park? Yeah, what's so all these German I theme parks? Man. We went to one on our like yeah, special. Yeah, exactly the same. Yeah. Right. Um, so yeah, you kind of. You kind of, yeah, so I did the 5K one because oh, yeah. I let Chris handle it. So I, I got there and then this Australian woman goes, oh yeah, I've been meaning to meet, I've been meaning to meet you. 
And I was like, oh, <laughs> I was like, oh, hi. And because she goes, oh, that's that's uh, that's the uh, the uh, the person who organizes the entire Spartan race. I was oh, it's like, organized oh, by an Australian yeah. woman? <laughs> I was like, oh shit. She's really lovely and really nice. Sorry, oh, yeah. sorry I butchered your accent. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I'm offended for you, don't worry. Yeah, and then she was like, yeah, come do it. She was like, yeah, so we do it. Mm. I'm like, I don't really know what to expect other than I know I saw a bit of Chris's videos. Mm. Yeah. So I know I gotta climb a row. Mm. Uh, does it it's, show you the obstacles? It's kind of like a like a mock Sasuke race type of thing. Is that right? a sack? Race? That's the kids version. That's the okay. Kids. You're, oh, looking, looking, was... you're looking at the kids version. <laughs> I didn't do the kids version. All right. All right okay. I was like, for the record, I would have beat all of them. All right, but I didn't do that. One. I was like, I didn't know Spartans uh, were yeah. like going across. Yeah, yeah. I, I think sacks. I think I've seen a lot of footage from it. You have to like do like climb up a rope, do mm -hmm. army core so, stuff. Yeah, yeah. So we you yeah. start off. You we ran like two k, which mm. man, I I hate. Running. Same. Same. I, I, I can literally bike across Japan. <laughs> literally, not not fit. Like, you know, I you cannot don't get, run. I you cannot don't, run. Don't get the runners high that all these I runners talk about. I, you know, I think nah, it's because <laughs> <I, laughs> that's from, from yeah. a very young age. I always used to get um, shin splinters. Like, right. Uh, shin wait, splinters. Yeah, where your shin, the bone, right in the middle, like there, oh. start to really fucking hurt. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And whenever I run, it just always hurts. Well, it's um, because of the force. Yeah, right? yeah. I'm too dummy thick, right? <laughs> uh, that's why you're good at cycling. Your shins are cracking under the weight yeah. of it's your like, It's <laughs> like, <laughs> like my calves are great, my thighs are monstrous, yeah. but like it's all put, being put on like here. Yeah, right? yeah. It's just not enough. Yeah. So like, yeah, you do kind of stuff like this. There's like- uh, Look at this giga chat on the bottom yeah. left here. Yeah. God uh, damn. Um, you don't have to do the the date. You can just type in the obstacles. Mm. Yeah. You know, it's it's so you, you we'd run like, I, was, I thought it'd be more spaced out. So I thought you'd run a little bit, obstacle run a little bit. This one was like, you ran mm. like a K, did a thing where you jumped over a fence. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It was kind of inconvenient. Yeah. It's like, it wasn't, it wasn't hard. <laughs> Uh, it was very tiring. Jumping yes. is tiring. Yeah. yeah. And then run like another 500 meters and then you have to do, jump over like, uh, kind of like, they, they called them, uh, what's the, what do they call them in the Olympics? The uh, hurdles. Mm -hmm. yeah. They were just really big. Mm. I nailed one of them though. You can see in the Mudan VOD. Actually, yeah, we just pulled the Mudan video. Actually, yeah, Mudan made a fucking video like yeah, showing yeah. all the obstacles. This is, why, why am I trying to do this? <laughs> Mudan um, video. I love the thumbnail of this Mudan video because you and Mudan look so chill and Chris in the back is like. Dude, <laughs> <laughs> Mudan did it all in a suit. And and I there yeah, were so many there were so many weapon, crazy right? costumes. <laughs> there were so many crazy costumes and Mudan got the most compliments or like questions. Everyone was like, suit suit? Yeah, why is he in a suit? And I was like, oh, you might kill us, you got the suit. <laughs> <laughs> they were like, they were like, so we sat, started the start line. Yeah. yeah. It was kind of like, yeah, whatever we go through. And then we just run for ages. Why is Mudan always wearing a suit? I don't know. Right? I don't know. He's just dedicated to that salary, man. Like, yeah, yeah, he, he is. A, the day was roasting. Also he was wearing, Chris was wearing the horrible shorts that you. Which, oh, oh, well, oh the no. one with my face on it. Yeah. <laughs> oh God. Um, <laughs> Why? <laughs> so we're doing like a brisk little jog. You yeah. know, it's just that it's yeah. kind of whatever. And then- What was the hardest oh, part? There's the first obstacle, there you go. Yeah. yeah. Uh, so you just jump like, like tiny little fence. You're like, okay. Okay, yeah. that, that doesn't look too bad. Yeah, and then you gotta, yeah. so we nailed it. How many of those fences do you, do you need to jump through? Well, just one of those, and then you gotta mm. do a bigger one. Yeah. All right, it's like a wall. Yeah, it's just a wall. Okay. Up a okay. wall. That's cool. No, that's not too bad. You're yeah. like, all right, it's chill. Yeah. Cool. And then you go, uh, you might have skipped. Was that what? Yeah, that's it. That's it. Yeah, yeah, go there. Is there a wireless mouse? I could just go through it for you. <laughs> oh, you skipped one as well. <laughs> Can't believe Mudan is doing all this is in a wireless? fucking suit, man. Dude, I, I took him to a spot show. wireless, right? Where the, you know the, the place in round one where you can do all the sports upstairs? Oh yeah. He was wearing a suit for that as well. <laughs> and people were just like, why is this <laughs> random ass salary man playing tennis in a suit? Like, <laughs> he's just too dedicated to that he, bit, Cause man. he got the perfect suit factory suit and uh, they have like the really breathable the, the stretch. Cool oh, ones. the stretch yeah. ball. So good. Uh, the stretch They're ball. game changing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, oh. yeah just show All right, let's, let's see this. So once you do that, you immediately then run past some goats Mm -hmm. oh, that's me, wow. Sugoi, Sugoi strong there. Sugoi strong. <laughs> you go up another, go down. A, the, man, some of these hills were dicey. Okay. And then you basically, <laughs> I don't know what Mudan did. Is, is, this your jump. is this your point of view? No, this is Mudan. Oh, why, <laughs> why did he throw that bottle like a frag? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what he was hoping to like achieve there. <laughs> So you jump <laughs> over it. Yeah, why is he, the why is he oh. got his bag on him? Oh, I nailed that one. Uh, so you jump over that. It's kind of tiring because you have to like really Sprinted it, otherwise, yeah, you don't do it. This one's super of a joke. You just go under, right, yeah, right. under, then over. You know, just wow, Sugoi, yeah. super Spartan, just like the Spartans, just like the Spartans used to do. Like the Spartans <laughs> used to do. <laughs>
<laughs> and then you're like, okay, it's just it's just like tiring. And then you have to carry this like, I don't know how heavy it was. It felt like 40 or 35 kilograms. Okay. Oh, just wow. around, walking around a course. It was right. just tiring. You're like, God damn it. It wasn't like tough. It was just <laughs> annoying. <laughs> um, what a raving review. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Spot, spot it was, race. It's not tough. It's just mildly irritating. And then you jump over this. Not too difficult. Yeah. I think so like- did, did, ever, did basically everyone that competed did they pass the No, course? no. So a lot of people, if you just can't do it, you have to do like a punishment burpees thing. Okay. And then this was really easy, but a lot of Japanese people are struggling with this. You have to pull like a 20 kilogram weight across the ground. Right. Okay. And it's not too bad. As you can see, I'm, I'm next to Muda and them. Yeah. yeah. But like, obviously you can see like a lot of the Japanese people were like really struggling. Yeah. <laughs> but it wasn't that heavy. I feel like if you're, like if you do any muscle workout, it's not too bad. Mm, like, yeah. Uh, I actually, okay, yep. Actually, <laughs> <laughs> uh, there's, there's Connor uh, single-handedly just breaking uh, something else. And then this um, one, uh, they, okay, then this one, you have to do like a, pull a sack of sand up. Mm, right. Everyone was like, you have to, it's so hard. You have to do this crazy technique um, where you- Where you use both your hands. <laughs> so you can see everyone's like really like using all of their body. Yeah, yeah, They're yeah. Like going for it and helping each other out. And uh, it's just a sack of sand. So yeah. like, it's, mm. I mean, it's, you know, it's not too bad. Yeah. yeah. Mudan he was using his entire body weight and like falling on the ground. Uh and then I How heavy is the sand? I don't know. I don't think it's that bad. I think it's like it doesn't look 30. that heavy. Yeah. Um so I, I was just pulling it up. Yeah. Not yeah. too bad. And then monkey bars. Oh no, this one you have to run up a hill. So oh yeah, you gotta like the use dreaded the rope. hill. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, but you can uh you don't need to use the hill. Well, you can just kind of like this looks like uh, Takeshi's castle. Oh yeah, now. you can do that as well. Yeah, you can just go <laughs> up it. And then you have to walk down it. It's not too bad. Like a lot yeah. of these are kind of hard to fail. This one's this one's definitely a little monkey harder. Bars, yeah. yeah, monkey yeah. bars. Yeah. <laughs> was oh, that yeah. Chris? Holy dude. shit, he just ate <laughs> shit. Yeah. Dude, Chris nearly did it. I, I was so impressed because Chris said like he had no chance. Because obviously Chris is, doesn't do a lot of upper body workouts. Yeah. And he nearly made it. Oh. <laughs> he ate shit though. He did eat Fuck. shit. I feel with monkey bars, you just have to go for it. The problem was with this is that they were really sweaty. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Everyone had sweated them up. So I was trying, to, it was really hard to get a good grip, uh, but I was trying to monkey it. Across. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, yeah, yeah. That's how I would do it. Yeah, I was swinging across and I, yeah. I think uh, no one else was doing that. Everyone was not using their momentum. <laughs> you you knew how to monkey. Yeah, properly. I was like, guys, come on. Yeah, look at you, man. Yeah. And look then at you. you hit a bell. What a, what a fucking it. natural. Um, but but I didn't do it. Yeah. Uh, and then you carry another sack around. Just, just inconvenient. Just a lot of sacks. Just a, the, minor, yeah, the just a minor inconvenience. By far the worst one, and yeah. not for the reason you would expect. Is that, look at the congestion. Look at these. Look at this dude, bro. What is he doing? What is bro doing? <laughs> blood, blood, blood's <laughs> planking. Bro. There was like literally like yeah. There was one guy who was scraping his entire back. It was real barbed wire. Oh shit. Oh, it was okay. real barbed wire. Okay. So, like, and he was like, what is bro doing? <laughs> bro, bro did not want to get dirty. <laughs> but like at one point in half, at halfway, it got so close that even when I was on the ground, it was like yeah. scraping my back. Oh shit. Uh, and I was just congested. And obviously I'm dummy thick. So I'm like my- So my your ass, ass is just- So your ass is just like snake. protruding snake. through snake. the my ass. Look, at, look, at, look at that. Oh, I can't that's believe that's actual. Oh. Look at the, look at the, look at the going and then like i <laughs> i i got i got stuck waiting uh -huh. and then i was talking to a guy because the guy goes hi uh oh, where are you from i was yeah. like uh uk he goes do you know ulster i was like what yes ulster it's a ulster? place in the uk oh okay oh. he was like i've been there very nice and then the guy go <laughs> the guy behind me screams like go go and i was like bro we are all stuck. It's traffic. Yeah. By far the worst one because you're like, I, you couldn't even attempt to do it fast. Also, you could like actually physically get hurt oh, because they're yeah, real yeah. barbed wire. Uh, more monkey bars, but ones that swing. Yeah. Very, very. These nice. one looks easy. Yeah, these right? one look easy. Yeah, yeah, super chill. You can just swing across like a monkey, which mm, yeah. for some reason no one was doing. You can skip everything if you just like, just yeah. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah. Climb over something. Super easy. So Obviously, you've done you've done a run. Climb a rope to the top. Okay. So what's the hardest part? Probably the rope one, honestly. The rope is kind of tough because mm. if you on, don't have any, like you just can't cheat it. Yeah, like, if you don't yeah, have any yeah. upper body strength as well. Yeah, like, I, I would fucking fail at this because I have no upper body strength. Everyone was doing some kind all. of weird leg technique and I was like, you know what, fuck it. Let's just, let's just grab my, I'll just squeeze it to my legs and go up. <laughs> No, I mean, that, what that, do you mean yeah. by weird that's, leg that's technique? That's the right way to do it. Everyone, yeah. you can kind of- Look at this dude on the left though. Yeah. This is fucking yeah. three-legging that shit. Oh gone. my God. <laughs> you can kind of do some like leg technique, I think, which maybe Mudan, like this, you can kind of lock your legs to make like a ladder. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, just throw a javelin, but you had, to, it was, you had to wait like nine hours to do it. 
pick up a ball that weighed 40 kilograms and walk around the pole. Okay. This guy's, Most just, chill this guy's just chilling, man. That's Paracynical's editor. <laughs> oh, oh, is it? <laughs> yeah. This one, this one, a lot of Japanese people struggled with. Mm, uh, okay. Because I think a lot of the strength ones, Japanese people weren't as good at. Yeah. Yep, yeah. A lot of them couldn't even pick up the ball. Um, <laughs> and it, I mean, it's heavy to be fair. Mm. And then my favorite part of the entire video, enti all this is watching me walk up this. Well, like straight up. Look, look, wait, wait, it's gonna cut. <laughs> <laughs> this is the best shot. Dude, every, this guy, when he passes this guy, he was in awe. He was like, what the fuck is bro doing? <laughs> He looks so he out of place he, in that. Like. He walked up it. Just straight up walked up it. What a badass. Yeah. Just a casual stroll. So like, it's like a lot of different, difficult, like I was definitely very sore the next day because mm. it's just a lot of like- How long like did it take? Your way. Um, I think from start to finish, it was about an hour and a half. Okay, not too bad. Um, okay. Honestly, the worst part was just getting there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it, it is I mean, it's far. in uh, far, Chiba, man. you said, right? Fucking Chiba, fucking, yeah. yeah. And the traffic on the way back was miserable. Yeah. yeah. Would you it say was there was more like foreign people or like Japanese people? Uh, Japanese people. There was definitely a lot of foreigners. But okay. Uh, more Japanese. I would do it, but I think I would do the 10K next time. I think the 5K was a bit awkward because you kind of run a little bit and then you're like, oh, it's, oh, I'm just waiting in line. For yeah, yeah, yeah. You took Q. Yeah. It doesn't feel very Spartan like. Mm. You're like, who are we? <laughs> DMV lines. <laughs> like, you're like, uh, That's the British race. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, what are we doing? Uh, we are, we're, we're queuing. You should, uh, <laughs> do, do you know about the Iron Man challenge? Oh my God, that shit's fucked. Well, they do it all over the world. Yeah. It's like a branded thing. Yeah, yeah. The, That's the, the Australian one. It's like though. triathlon on t like heroin. <laughs> yeah, it is. It is a triathlon from hell, basically. Do you know, do you know about it? It is, bro. It is. No, I've never heard of this. The, so the Iron Man, can you look up the Iron Man challenge? I, you, actually, I can tell you how many calories I burnt on the day as well. All right. I'll tell you on the spot. Yeah, the, the, the Iron Man challenge. I, I had a friend who used to do these like every single year. <laughs> when I streamed 16 hours a day. I did 600 steps yesterday. 600 steps. <laughs> um, but yeah, I, there you go. Iron Man triathlon uh, right. is one of the series of long distance triathlon races consisting of a 2.4 mile swim, 112 mile bicycle ride and a marathon. All right. Not bad. Not bad. And you have to do all that. How many calories? <laughs> Not bad. <laughs> 4,000 oh, 4, 4, calories. That includes uh, the daily burning yeah. calories. So about, oh, okay. So overall the day I, I walked 21,000 steps. Yeah, not bad at all. That's a good workout. Yeah, there you go. That's the next one you should do. <laughs> Iron Man. <laughs> next stream? Next stream? Next stream, Iron yeah. Man. But I think the thing is, is that I think uh, if I prepped enough, I could do it slowly. Mm -hmm. But a lot of these, a lot of these things have like time limits. Mm. Yeah. They, they got to wrap up. <laughs> oh, that's true. That's true. Yeah. I think I'm good at uh, just, when I get to a certain level of fitness, I can just do stuff, mm. but not great. Mm. Like, I'm not clean with it. But the fact that you have to do a marathon, fuck. Yeah, that's after a 2.4 mile swing and 112 mile bicycle ride. Jesus Christ. <laughs> no, thank you. Yeah. That's oh. weird. Like how you'd have to, I think by far the hardest part would be the marathon for me. Oh mm -hmm. yeah. The bicycle ride, that would take a long time though. Yeah. <laughs> you would know. You would you know. You would know. Yeah. You probably know the best. I mean, it depends how, my God, that's it. That's ridiculous. What is like the average finish time? 100 and That's gotta be like a full 12 ride. hour thing, surely. I'm sure, yeah, okay. 12 yeah, hours, right. 12 hours yeah. and 49 minutes. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> well, yeah, cause if I, cycling two point, uh, swimming 2.4 miles is tough. My, mm. my mom does insane amounts of swimming. Mm. I could mm -hmm. ask her. Uh, she, she's done triathlons. Not uh, Iron Man ones. Yes. I wish I could do more swimming because I, I do actually enjoy swimming a lot. And also it's great just as a workout thing as well because it's it like works one of the best, every muscle yeah. in your and body. And it's non-impact. So it doesn't yeah. hurt your joints or anything like running does. But the does. problem is, man, like going finding to a, a gym. Yeah, <laughs> finding a pool. Finding yeah, a pool yeah, yeah. yeah, in Japan and not paying out the ass is like level impossible. Yeah. There's a few members only ones, but it's like, dude, if I have to like commute 30 minutes to go to the gym, no. it's already game over. Yeah, I'm not going. Fuck that. <laughs> 2.4 miles away, oh my God, that's fucked. Yeah. Dude, um, doing a marathon, not even a marathon, 26, why? Why? 